and welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to more FIFA 20. Now we've got pre-season still. This is the third game. I've lost two already. 4-3 to Al Nasir and 3-1 when I was in the lead to Wolves. So now we've got Leicester. So I'm hoping I can pull out a bit more of a better performance in this game than the last one or the last two, so to speak. Okay, so we're going to jump right into the game now and see what happens. So now, let's play Leicester. Well, this wonderful city offers the visitors so much, including football. Barcelona, of course. I'm Derek Ray, and joining me for commentary is the former Arsenal defender, Lee Dixon. And we have more live action from the pre-season okay, group off. stage for you to look forward to. I hope to. we can play better than we did in the last two pre-season games. That was absolutely yeah, shocking. Both teams looking to finish the group strongly and make a positive start to their seasons. You have to say it's been a great tournament up to Such now. a close the game against Al Nasir. Getting to meet the players, getting their shirts signed. 3-3, three, three, down to 4-3. It was back when I used end. to play in pre-season games, that's for sure. 1-0 up at Wolves, down 3-1 at now the end. Indeedy. And the Barcelona shape looks like this. This particular setup is becoming more and more in favour. Right. Yes, Derek, one central striker, two wingers oh, will provide the width, a very narrow. Just needed a bit of placement. A back four and two control the ball. Ball to be to one, but also defend and help out the centre backs. Now he must favour the cross. Here's how Leicester City will line up. Ben Chilwell starts with Ricardo Pereira in the fullback positions. Yuri Tiedemans plays alongside Wilfred and Didi in the centre of midfield. And the idea is to have just the one striker up there trying to pose problems for the opposition. One. Well, great read there to intercept. Good looking ball. There could be a chance now. Iannaccio. No, well, the no way. The way Not at the beginning. Well, you do feel, Derek, with the pressure they're putting on this team, a goal will come. They can't get much closer than that, can they? Wagge. Well, someone has found the net in one of the other games. Here's Alan McInerney to tell us more. It's a goal for the home team. Nine minutes played, 1-0. Thanks, as ever, for the update, Alan. Well, they've Lost lost the possession of the ball. Again. Race and very deftly cut out. No, I was concentrating on putting Messi in. It did work. James. Now Ianacha. Good vision. Can he get onto this? Gray. The defender doing his job. Absolutely spot on, and they keep the ball. There. Well, you've got to try to make it a bit more difficult for your opponent than that. Race. What? Can he take the chance? He had no, to react. What's going and on? Did. Oh. Wagge. Messi, and let's join Alan McAdally because I understand there's been a goal in the Leverkusen game. Alan. It's a goal for Bayer Leverkusen. It's been scored by Kevin Folland. He picked the ball up just inside the opposition half, ran unopposed to the edge of the area before firing home. 14 minutes played, 1-0. Thanks, Alan. And with that, the attack fizzles out. This is Vidal. Read it magnificently and intercepted. Oh, this is a funny old game. You're getting somewhere, but then you're not. Then you it's think you are, and you're not again. James now. Chill well. Tielemans. Well, it was a risky challenge, but brilliantly executed. 
And everyone in the centre looking on as it sailed over them. So Yunchu has it. Ricardo Pereira. Diabate. Ricardo Pereira. Cleared away. One. Possession lost. Oh, it's going to go back to Messi there. He's played it out of place. He's found a pocket of space. Ricardo Pereira. And space for the cross. Not too fussy in clearing his lines. Messi. Brace. Well, I must say, no shortage of space for Barcelona. Are they going to forge ahead? No, well, how did you not get that, that anywhere fuss. near the goal? Oh, dear me. Don't know what's going on here. And over comes the corner. Far from a good pass. Quick thinking to dispossess his opponent. And slipped through beautifully. Oh! My goodness, Lee. The goalkeeper had his work cut out for him, but delivered. Yeah, that's what they do. Look at Messi got on the end of that. Effort. Thunderous shot. That probably would have gone had the keeper not been in that position. Corner kick played over. And putting his body on the line. Oh. And plenty of scope to be creative in that wide position. Not to be in terms of the cross there. Goal kick coming up. Well, there's been so much talk about a potential transfer, but it's potential no more. It's fact. Well, it's almost the perfect transfer. Everybody's happy. That's the sign of a good deal. Selling club happy, buying club happy, and boy, is the player happy. Good tackle. Barca maintain possession. Advantage. Given away. Oh, dear. What happened there? I had the ball, it suddenly just sprung off and Gray. went to the other person. Gray, a strong play here on the shielding front. Chilwell, a chance to whip it in. And offside it is. The referee has gone back now to hand out the yellow card. Opted for the laissez-faire. Most would but... say good refereeing league. No, it's absolutely spot on. Keep the game going as long as you can, but then you can always go back and book him after the ball's gone out of play. Good refereeing. Wage. Oh dear, he just walks in and gets it. Ianacho has it. Couldn't keep it. Messi. This is Vidal. They've regained oh, possession. Come on. Passing shocking. Can they hit on the break? Ianacho. And for grabs off the keeper. Really good reading of the game to win possession back. Vidal, perfect tackle. And news of a goal on the Monaco match. Alan McAnally with the details. It's a goal for Monaco. 35 minutes played. 1 1. Cheers again, Alan. Precise. Vidal yes. Pass. 
Yes, we finally broke the deadlock. Genius. It really is genius. What a finish. Well, let's see that strike again. First time is always very, very difficult saw to strike him. a ball. Through the ball, timing first has to be time right. shot. The technique has to be right. Straight into the you back of the net. Concentrate on the ball as it's coming to you. You know you're not going to take a touch. Concentration is everything. Well, all the hard work has paid off, but the manager knows a lot more has to be done to secure this game. So the game has restarted, and it's Barcelona in front. That's plenty of know-how in the ball-shielding department. Chilwell. Ndidi. Now Ricardo Pereira has it. Happy to pass the ball, but... Well, he's got to score. Well, a moment he would dearly love to have back. Well, listen, he's tried to hit it too hard. Just terrible. relax a little bit, focus on your technique. James now. Tielemans. Crossing opportunity. Accurate ball and draws the near post. Well, that would be straightforward for any keeper. Now here's Arturo Vidal. Messi. Poor attempt at a pass, really. Mm -hmm. I don't know what he was doing there. He just changed position. Great. The football went straight to the opposition then. Taking care of business defensively here. Vidal, Messi, this is Vidal, run it magnificently and intercepted. Well, great read there to intercept. Gray now, Tielemans, Diabate. Cleared away comprehensively. Vidal. Messi. Oh, you've got to say miles off target. Well, if it had just bent it or maybe just gone for a bit more accuracy. Instead, he went for the strong shot and he just fluffed his lines. Hughes, Ndidi, Diabate, here's Tielemans, now Ndidi, and he was in the right place to intercept, given away, Tielemans. Well, nice. The first 45 minutes have come and gone here in Catalonia. One minute up at half time. You've certainly got to give this man high marks for his work up to this point, Lee. Well, Derek, it certainly was a good 45 minutes from the lad. Obviously, got the goal to give him the lead, but he's looked very, very lively as well. Right, so Anasu 0-0 with Wolves, Jumbo Kaindo 1-1 with Monaco, Ulsen Hoyendo 1-0 down to Leverkusen. Right, and we're 1-0 up. This is the killer, because when we actually have a 1-0 lead at half-time, in the second half it always seems to go wrong. So I'm hoping this time it doesn't. We've got a couple of red thumbs. Sideways pass is impossible, try to keep possession or take on the opponent, make sure the teammates open to receive short pass. I show class impressive through balls, accurate short passes help retain possession. So let's see if we can actually win one this time in the second half and let's go. Well 
Well, the first half is history. Now we wonder what the second half is going to produce. Leicester City have kicked off. Well, possession is not a problem for Leicester, but after that, it's been disappointing. I'd like to see them use those wide areas around the defence, get round them, I suppose, to trying to go through the middle. I must say, no shortage of space. And options in the centre. Possession oh, change of hands, the interception there. He's using his strength to good effect. Dangerous looking through ball. I knew it. I said it, didn't I? I said it. Right before the second half kicked off. It's the LB button takes ages to tag one of your other teammates to actually make the defensive decision. By that time you've done that, everybody's running in and scoring against you. You try to change your player with the LB button and it goes to the one that's furthest away. That cost Even me that Steven dude. Really cost me. Vidal. The possession lost, intercepted. Well, this is the home of live football, EA TV, and we have more. Tremendous ball played through. Perez. Ndidi. Now they've lost it. Barcelona moving the ball swiftly. My goodness, the importance of getting oh, there. Oh, nearly it. Lost on the keeper. And a throw-in it's going to be. Well, they've been getting the substitute ready, and now they will make the personnel change. Now here's Arturo Vidal. Race. Options in the centre. Smuggled away. I'm still upset about Racing losing that goal. Trying to catch them out. Man, that L button, it takes A ages pass. to tag the right player. That's why he had that big break on. And he's he managed to space. get in there. A oh, tremendous vision. Still pushing for the goal that would put them ahead, but not forcing it. Barcelona have been awarded the throw-in. Well, they have elected to go to the bench at this stage of the game. And that's an important intervention. Oh, they've lost it. And space for the cross. And that was a very fine read. James Madison. Give it away. De Jong. No. And we're inside the final 30 minutes. And Jose Perez with it. De Jong. Now oh, the pass not finding its target. No, the pass didn't go. Gray. And he's broken free. Well, oh, that's very smart defending, and now they have the ball again. Teammates in the middle. And the goalkeeper will see that as part of doing his job. <sighs> and over comes the corner. 
Just too close to the goalkeeper in the end, wasn't it? Yeah, Port. Oh, he's given the ball away. Indeedy. Plenty of forward momentum here, but can they produce? Superb defensive judgment to end the attack. Gray now. Chilwell. Gray. Tielemans. Nothing wrong with that idea. I can't get down the wing or move or anything now. Mark or Brighton now. And he was in the right place to intercept. Now here's Arturo Vidal. Miranda. Oh, come on! Perez couldn't keep it. What was that? And I didn't even press the button at all. They will now make use of the substitutes bench. Oh, we need the three points. We fed up the losing or drawing. Ricardo Pereira. I've never drawn yet, but I don't know. Really Goal Brighton now. PK with it. There's a slide draw pass. Don't you dare! Position. Oh, for fuck's sake! This happens every time. Well, in this replay, you're going to see a 2v1 against the keeper. How does that Trying to attack that bloody player again. Why he was left exposed. Nothing he could do. So they're playing once more. Will Barcelona be able to bounce back? So 20 minutes to go. Well, real difficulty keeping the ball. And let's join Alan McInerney because I believe there's been a goal on the Monaco match, Alan. It's the second goal for Monaco. 72 minutes played. 2-1. Thanks very much as always, Alan. Possession changes hands. The interception there. Messi. Now Vidal. Well, it was no. never going to worry the keeper. Well, no wonder he's looking a little bit sheepishly at his teammates. Head in a hand sort of moment. Tremendous intuition to win it back. At times you think he has a sixth sense, Arturo Vidal. Goal. The offside flag. Oh, to come go. on! And it did. Yeah, look along the line. Look along the line. God's sake. Samuel Umtiti. Messi. Well, still searching for the equaliser, but not passing it anxiously. Rakitic. De Jong. And return to Rakitic. And the keeper taking care of the situation. Vidal. Now Griezmann. Rakitic on the ball. Crossing possibilities. And delivered towards the back post. Corner. Very clear who got the last touch. So a corner coming up. Well, here's something we don't say terribly often. Lionel Messi has been a long way from his best, not really making his mark in this match league. Yeah, definitely, Derek. He's been below par today, not tested the keeper enough. The team do rely on him as well, and he's not done it today. That's why they're down in this game. Simple. An unforced error, you've got to say. Griezmann. And will it be the leveler? Yes! We did it! We're back in! Finally! We're back in the game! Well, here is the replay, and to be fair, the keeper from that distance hasn't got much chance of keeping it out. Lovely goal. A chance to revisit the goal.
and level again here. This has been quite the roller coaster ride. Well, just listen to the atmosphere in here. It certainly has been cranked up a notch or two. You think there's going to be another chance or two before the final whistle? James Madison. Or Jose Perez. Strongly in, PK. I don't believe that. I was on the run. James Madison. Here's Chilwell. That move looked as though it had genuine potential, but it's broken down. De Jong. Messi. Get up. Rakitic. Plenty of oh, players nice waiting one. in the middle. Ivan Rakitic going infield. Messi. Simple catch, really. Oh. Now Griezmann. Messi. A case of foiling the opposition by whatever Shots means. Lost. Dealing with the threat that was real. All Brighton. Here's Tielemans. Mark All Brighton now. Tielemans. Very clever defending by Ivan Rakitic. The possession lost, intercepted. Oh, no! Post. No! Miles off target. Dear me. No! Close your eyes when you're watching this one. It's horrific. Look at that! And he poached then over the top. No! Well, he'd be disappointed about that end product, but he'd be happy they're creating a chance or two. Madison with it. Gray. James Madison. Now indeedy. Zoyun Chu has it. Tielemans. And a goal at this stage could be decisive. Showing a real desire to win it back. We've been waiting to find out. Now we know. A minimum of three added minutes here. Ricardo Pereira. Well, great read there to intercept. What sort of tackle Cross was that? Free kick. It'll be here. It's well bad. Now here's PK. Given away. Oh, it's just about to throw the ball there. In position here to protect the ball. Oh, Brighton. Couldn't keep it. It's the high pressure, high intensity approach. No, we've got the draw. The full time. analysis a really positive performance from this man Lee well that was an important equalizing goal in the game with not that many chances but he put that one away perfectly well oh scored in every game I've played and I still can't win a game yet 2-2 two, two at full time 0-0 nil, nil, Wolves, Jabon Grande 2, Monaco 2, also in Hyundai 0, Leverkusen 1 Right, upcoming targets. For the next few fixtures, I see us having a tough time against one or two of the clubs. We should pick up some points. We have a match against Valencia CF coming up. I expect a massive effort against them. Right, so we've got to get an average match rating of 9. Goals created, we expect you to create at least 4. And a pass completion rate of 90%. Okay. So there we have our layout for the upcoming match. Oh, this is a nice little screen. Looks completely different. It's gone into the uh, different colour now. The menu looks like it's completely different as well. So, yeah, we've got the match against Valencia and we're playing away. So, we'll do that when we come back. Our pre-season hasn't gone the way we expected, but at least we can try and make 
an effort to produce a good result in each game for the La Liga season. So I hope you enjoyed what you've seen so far. If you have, leave a like and a comment. Let me know what you think. Thanks for watching and I will see you on the next video. Bye-bye for now.